Do you have money? You can buy anything. Everyone says, just do you. Well, this is me. My whole life is a routine. I keep track of my time, my money, my grades. It's been two years in the States and I've learned to accept being average. To be a realist. Everyone in the city is chasing something far away. They know where to go and they walk fast. Just like everyone else. Me? I'm not working for anything but a stable future. In a city of dreams and dreamers, some find it wrong. They tell me, just be you. You will know what you really want. Well, this was me a year ago, when my school club decided to throw a house party the day before my midterm. But it was also the day I found a different sense of purpose. Maybe even what they call a dream. I found myself overdressed, but apart from a formal, I only had school shirts. But she told me she liked my watch. I couldn't think straight. Before her, I weaved tales to match the things she liked about me. The way I dressed, the authors I knew, the things I knew apart from school. The next time we met in person was a month later. It was sort of a date. She looked amazing that day. She said she liked what I wore, thank God. We walked around the park, talked. I told her stories of where I came from, what I did, anything that was vaguely interesting. She told me she enjoyed herself. But when I stopped talking, she stopped talking. And in those moments of silence, I could feel her interest peel off. I wish I had more going on in my life. That night, she asked me where I lived. I couldn't tell her I lived here. It didn't match my watch. You have three missed calls and one voice message from Ruby. It's Ruby. I just got back home. 
Last night, my handbag got stolen near your apartment. It had my phone, my wallet, everything. I tried finding you at your place. Signage, right? You said you lived at signage at the top floor. I asked the security guard to bring you. They said they couldn't find your name in there, not on any of the floors. They told me to get out. I spent all night walking back to my house. Michael, why did you have to lie? That night, the thief ran off and no one helped me. Where were you?